I made this afternoon, um, there were some issues with it because uh, I had put on something. I got interrupted a couple of times, and so I, I put, you know, um, I'll be right back on the screen, but then I'd be right back on the screen, stayed throughout the rest of the video, and I was talking about that new case. I was showing photos. You didn't see them, so what I did was downloaded that. I I cut out the beginning with the Jodi area stuff, just put the stuff back with the case of a Lauren and then just uploaded some photos with that. So at least you're not looking at something that says, I'll be back soon. Anybody that's looking at that. So that's why I re-uploaded that. Now I'm here to show you guys something. I got these shells. Um, I ordered these. I can put a link in the video description. I ordered them on Amazon. I ordered the scall scallop shells. Oh my gosh. The oyster shells on Amazon as well. I can put a link in the video description. These are, you saw that I did the oyster shells. These are really fun to do. Um, I have to get some more oyster shells because I love doing them, but I ordered these large shells right here. And I've already picked out some napkins that I want to use on them. So I cut them out and I just have to peel the layers off. But this, I'm going to do with this. This one, I'm going to use this. And this one, I'm going to use this, right? Okay. All right. Now, I also have this, which is a uh, just, a, just a saucer, okay? So you can use those to decoupage on. Everybody asks what I'm using. I usually use a napkin decoupage, but I if I can't find that, I use the aliens. I do not use the... Mod Podge to do the actual decoupage. I just think sometimes it's too thick, but I do use it like the gloss to give me that nice, um, oh, hold on a minute, my trial's coming on. Yeah, my trial's back on. I'm watching that uh, Waffle House trial while I'm going on, but it gives you the nice um, shine. There is also a Mod Podge, what I found out is called Brilliance, and you might want to do that. This is just a trinket box I picked up at the Dollar Tree. I haven't put the, I want to seal it with a, the glossy, but you can do that, you know. Um, I bought some more of those to do as well. Then I used my printer to print out some classic Easter onto cardstock. And what I'm going to do with these is... Ouch, ouch, what did I hit myself on? I picked up these in, in different colors at Dollar Tree. So there's two of them for a dollar. And you can actually do both sides. You could paint this side yellow, which I probably will do, and have two sides, especially if you're going to hang it somewhere where it might flip, okay? But I plan to decoupage that onto there. And what you do is where you see, like, you can either take an X-Acto knife and try to trim that white out because you don't want any white to show unless your background was white. But if you couldn't get it out, I can get that with an exacto. but let's say there was something like, um, I don't know, right in here. Then what you can do is just take green and fill it in with green. Okay. But that's, that's another thing. Um, but I, so I was, uh, trimming these up as, as I could now on the smaller ones, they also have the little smaller size eggs. And so you can paint and put your vintage there. You know. So let's see. This is a cute one. But I would probably, let me see. See, these will fit. I probably will paint the back with a yellow and do one and one or something like that. We'll see. You can also, so but that's it. Now, there's another trick too. If you wanted to make these thinner, you can take a piece of packaging tape, put it on the back, press it on, peel it off, and it'll peel off some layers of the paper. Isn't that so cute? Look at that. That printer, that's that HP Envy. Look how nicely it works. Okay, so that's that. Put these over here. 
So, right. Uh oh. Let's get started here. I need the tape because I, I have to make sure all the layers are off that. Um, So I'm just going to separate all the layers, take your tape, again, I, I'm always amazed that that works, I mean, <laughs> who would ever say that you're just going to strip the layers away and then you're going to put something on it, it's just crazy, um, or that it, that it won't even rip when you rip the stuff away. This one, see, I think it made to be down to the first layer, but you've got to check. Yeah, that's down. So this was a two-ply napkin. Okay. And this one, I already took one of the plies off, but I know this is two-ply. So there it is, okay? So I'm going to put that there. All right. Take that off. Now, I'm going to get... Little saran wrap. Okay, and I want to show you that I did work on this big heart, uh, the balloon heart, and it's drying. Okay, so I did get that going, and I have a video on it. I just haven't uploaded it because I haven't finished the, it uh, didn't finish drying. Okay, now, so I'm going to my saran wrap right here. And what we're going to do is I'm going to actually do it a little bit different than I usually do. And I'm going to put our medium on. Now you want to see how you're going to have your trinket tray. Now this one has a little bit of a like the, the shell is a little broken there. That's going to be okay. It's going to be fine. But you want to think now, is it going to be like that? Or is it going to be like that? So then I said, oh, no, it's going to be like that. I'm going to trim them up with gold around the edges. So now here, because I wanted this to be in the middle, here where that goes like that, what I can do is I can just take my blue paint once this is done and just extend blue paint and that's what I would do there if the gold, but I'm trying to get this so that it's, then it'll be like that. Okay. All right, so that's how I would want that one. Now, the easiest way to do this is when I get the placement where I want it that I just put a little bit. Don't don't move this, and I just put that there. So I don't have my thing open. That's not good. Okay, so I'll do this again. Make sure that this is where I want it. Okay, and then I'll just peel this back. Brushes. This is not my favorite brush, this one here. And so I'll take the saran wrap because then it won't stick. I know this this whole thing is like just so weird that this works, you know what I mean? Like whoever I really, I just have to say, I'd love to meet the person because 
I don't think they're alive anymore, but they must have went against everybody telling them this would never work. And then how did, how did they discover that, you know, plastic and this and that? It's just, it's crazy. But the, I've seen people with the, um, and those will smooth out when you put the stuff on top. I've seen people with uh, the, doing it on the glass and it's crazy. And I have to get that too. So now that, I'll put that down and then I'll put the stuff on top. And you can even watch this now, because I, of the way these are curved, I like to use the saran wrap. So I'll do that and use my finger as the brush. And then you can really feel what you're doing and you can smooth out wrinkles. And again, even if you have some wrinkles, it's okay. It usually looks really good or it dries where you can't even notice it. Just do the best you can and it looks really nice. Don't stress over it, it doesn't look greatest when it's wet and you might think oh well, gosh it's horrible but no just wait and just fold you you can take it off the edges later um, with a finger sander right uh Finger sander, if you don't have a finger sander, you can use an emery board. Jackie Burr got me a really nice finger sander. And, okay. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna let that one dry. All right, now we'll do this one. And again, how do you want your tray? So you can want it like, depending on, see, I, I kind of think this one, I don't know why I'm thinking this one goes like this. I want this one to go like this. Because I don't, I just think because it's square and the flowers are growing up that way. Okay, so let's do that. I don't know if, if you guys are getting hit with a storm. They're making it really big news all over the place that the country's being hit. So hope everybody's staying safe. We haven't gotten anything yet. It's supposed to come tomorrow night. I'm gonna do the same thing. So I'm just kind of putting this on because I'm gonna smooth it out with my finger. make sure that I have enough on there.
I'll let that one dry. And then we're with this one. So with this one, what do I want to do with this one? I think I want to do this one this way, like that. You can paint them with a pearlescent paint and then put, you don't have to do a, a tire one if you don't want to, but since these are so big and I just think we'll see how these come out. I'm going to trim them with the gold or the metallic. You could use any type of metallic, but gold is traditional. Right, you would think your napkin would just disintegrate whoever designed this, uh, whoever invented this art form, huh? They were really, it's, it's like magic, because uh, you, how can it work, you know? Just if you think about all of it, it's a little bit like a miracle. All right, so can you stop that music, please? Can you stop that music, please? Thank you. YouTube is nuts about music. Okay, and that's um, three. We're going to let those dry. And what was I going to do? Um, I just have to, let me just see here. See, I will, um, hold on a sec. Go in and hmm, try to get this off this thing here. I've always got to use, like, freaking staples. I can't stand the staples. Okay. So, we have this. And I want to decoupage this guy onto here. I think that looks very nice and vintage, so I'm going to put, you know, and I didn't even, let me see if I can do the, uh, watch, let me see. to go into a drawer there. I know I have a big mess here. I'm crafting on my island all the time, even though it's supposed to be in a craft room, but I just grabbed the, the roll of tape and I grabbed the one from the uh, post office, but whatever. I'm going to see if this will work. And this might work well because it's not, I don't think it's as tacky as the I'm just going to test it in the center. Let's just see what happens. That 
Let's see, that might not work well. Do you think you really do need, thank goodness for this glass top here. Um, I think you do need the really, really strong tape, but I'm not worried because this is not that thick. So I'm not gonna go freaking out about it. And I'm just gonna put this on the back of it, but you can do that with packing tape and the really you know, strong packing tape will take off a layer of your thing. My it's got hairs coming out of this brush, which I don't like. Okay, so I'm gonna put him right there. And then I'm going to go over him. He'll take a few coats, you know, to go over, but not right. I mean, they have to dry. I also want to do some glass plates. I got a few glass plates and I'll show you something else that I picked up that Lisa D picked up too. So put him over here and let me just, oh my gosh, I am just making the biggest mess here. Okay, I might take a bunch of stuff on this. Okay. All right. good enough right now. Put the brush there for a second. I'll show you something else. And I did I tell you last night when we ordered online we were able to order at the Dollar Tree for a dollar still. Now they've changed it. Everything is dollar twenty-five but they have these little tiny gnomes and like Lisa did her her stuff. She put like something different on the hat and you can do something different on the body, and it looked really cute. So these are ones I'm gonna decoupage and paint, both mixture of. The other thing we have, we ordered um, these, which we're gonna paint, okay? But we're gonna glue this onto there and then make a scene in here. It's gonna look really nice. So I'm gonna do that, Oops, something, and I also have some card shapes I'm going to dig on. I've got to get those ready right away because Valentine's Day is here. Uh, what else was I going to show? And then I got the glass plates, which I don't know. I think they're in the, um, I think they might still be in the car. Okay, but then I have this. I'm not sure what I want to do on there. And. Let me see if I want to do, got such a mess going on here, but see. You know, I was going to do that love lantern that I was going to do last Valentine's Day with those wood pieces. And um, instead, I'll tell you that. Honey, what? Day? Groundhog Day, Jimmy. Well, how about it's 2-2-2022. Okay. Okay. Yep. I um I don't know what I was saying. I really don't. I don't know what I was saying. I gotta push. I see some air bubbles coming up here. I don't know what I was saying. Oh, I wanted to make the lantern with these wooden uh, love things, and I don't know. Um, I think Jimmy moved them on me, so that might be another year that I don't make that. But maybe I'll make it for our anniversary if I don't get to it. Okay. All right, so that has to dry. What else can I do and show you? I, um... Hmm. 
egg shape. Let me go over there and get one of those beauty reference. I like to put these on the eggs, the Peter Rabbit. Uh, I've made them before, but I wanted to, maybe, I wanted to. If I wanted to make this vase, I could cut this part out, wrap it around the bottom, and um, but I'm not sure what I want to do with this. I love this napkin. I'm not sure what kind of vase I want to do. Okay, let's see. I do like this one too. This one makes a cute vase because you can put that on and then you can do a crackle. Um, but you can take this off you could put the Happy Easter, cut that out and put it over here or something, put another bunny here. But I'd want to give that another coat of paint if I wasn't going to do a wrap job. So, but I did a really pretty one um, the other year with the crackle on that. So many napkins, so little time. I have to do the acrylic pour too. Just don't. Uh, I have to watch some videos on that before I attempt that. Anyway, let's see. I'm trying to think what we could do for the. What I would like to put on the gnome. I mean, if we made this little guy an Easter gnome, I wonder, you know, what I think we could do for him? think that's what would be cute. Like if we did that and we decoupage that on his little hat. And then I think I would paint his beard white, paint his nose probably pink, and then he's got pants in the back and shoes. And when Lisa did this, like she took little pieces and just put little pieces. So, I mean, it is a little space. And I don't know exactly how you would, you see, if you could do a, you did the front of his hat. I don't know, Lisa always got has the vision. And uh, I'm wondering maybe if I should do I should paint his hat blue and then just find something that I can cut out and put on him, on his hat. I don't know, like flowers or something, but something that would uh, work out. I'm 
trying to think. I'm going to see what Lisa does because Lisa's going to do something and I don't want to and feel like she did a better thing. <laughs> okay. Uh, what else? I had all these things to do. Let's see. Hi, everybody. Hi, Kelly Bundizo. Hi, Crime Scene Cleaner. Hi, Nancy M. Hi, Deborah. I want to show you my doll, too, because you can't appreciate the legs and stuff the way it was. But this is all drying. Maybe I will do this while I'm drying. I know Nancy got one. I know Irene got one. And I know that... Um, who asked me today? J.A. or something. Okay. So... figure out what I'm going to do with that one yet. I do think I have to put another coat of paint on that one. So I don't think I'm going to do a, a wrap on that. So let me just really quick before we move on. Usually I like to paint the jars with that sponge thingy. Oh, and I also wanted to do a crepe paper flower, an Italian crepe paper flower. See, I'm always full of and my, my heart is still drying. I just want to get just another coat. I'm going to probably do three coats on here if I'm going to do, um, but I think I will end up doing a wrap on this. I have some things I want to just do as a wrap, so I'm not going to go crazy because I just need the undercoat there. Okay. That's it. Now, let me just clean this up, and I want to show you this baby. Sounds nuts. Okay, let me Oh no. I left her, oh shoot. I was thinking it was last night and I had her right here by the table. So I have her over there. I cut my hand so bad with a paper cut on one of these stupid bags. Something I was going to do. I don't know what it was though. Um, yeah, maybe. Let me see what can I do. Those are not going to be dry then. Maybe I'm just going to have to come back later or something. I don't know. I'm trying to think. I don't know what else I can do. I guess that really wasn't too productive, but. Um, Hmm. What did I want to show you? Anything else I want to show you? Huh. I could do the trinket box, but I'm, I hate it. Last time I had to do aggravated crafting. But yeah, 
this is I'm gonna give that like another coat of gloss but it's not it's not dry yet another coat of, and then I'm going to take any of the white areas that you see there and I'm gonna take some paint and go in there green okay that's the, uh, the retro thing and then I'm gonna paint the back yellow and put something on also on the back now um, Trying to think about which one I want to do. What do I want to do with that vase? Oh, soon to be vase. All right, I guess I'm gonna have to come back and show you this stuff after, and I'll probably have to put it into its own video. Like I'm gonna do the heart because the heart's not even ready yet. Um, all right, but I'll be back. I'll be back again someday soon. And we'll see, and I'll show you how these turn out. All right, because I, what did you say? If I get the ones that, what happened? I do get the ones that are for a premiere because you have the option to hit the reminder bell. What? Oh. Hi, Carol boys. Hi, Chelsea. Hi, Amy Celeste. Hi, Kevin Leonard. Ah, uh, what? Thanks, Mimi. Uh, I haven't been getting that. Yeah, it was pitiful this afternoon. It was absolutely pitiful. It's ready to close down the channel, seriously. Um, if nobody's getting notifications, I don't know what's going on. Hi, Nancy. Booby. Deborah. Catherine. Um, what is Kevin saying? Are you saying, so? please make sure you're subbed to the channel. You were unsubbed, Kevin? Oh, gosh. Hi, Danielle, Janae. I don't know if I'm getting everybody. Robin Lane. Oh, shoot. Hold on a minute, guys. I just hit the thing. Because there we go. Easily distracted. Nightmare. Mimi, Chu, Danielle. Please hit the thumbs up, so push the video. Yeah, our, our videos, uh, th our algorithm has been totally screwed with by these hate channels because um, they keep tagging us in all their hate channels. And it's been screwed up since the recliner did that. And uh, so that's great, but we'll get it. We'll get it back. Hey, you love, you love the lantern. Love Lantern. Oh, the Love Lantern? Yeah, I've got to get the, the Love pieces. Um, I think they're upstairs in one of the three draw things that Jimmy moved up there that was down here. So I've got to find the one and hopefully I can get it up. Thank you, though. Can we, let's see now. Yeah. Uh-huh. One piece. Let's see. Someday soon, yeah. I'll do it someday soon. Well, that's good. We do. All right. Um, I guess it's not that the, usually the time the time goes fast, but I can't think of what else I wanted to do. I can't. Why can't I think of what I want to do on that jar? Another jar. Yeah, the jar. Who are you talking? I'm talking to the chat. Hmm. I know what I could do on his hat would be those little um, lemon blossoms that would look really cute too on him. But I would have to... kind of put it on in pieces or something. I don't know. I, I, I see, This is what I mean. Sometimes I don't have the vision and then Lisa will say, how did you do that? And she'll be like, oh, I just put, I just put the pieces anywhere. Something. 
and I tend to be more of a rapper, and sometimes I do overthink things. If you haven't noticed, um, I don't know, sometimes I do. But I wanted to do also the vintage Valentines on the heart, and they have the uh, doilies too. I just have to print those out like I did the Easter vintage. And I did get a few, um, I have a few of my vintage Valentine stuff out, and I've got to get the other stuff away. But yeah, I want to get to that. Anyway, uh, have you been watching the trial? Today, your husband said, why are you getting packages from all over the United States? <laughs> Janae. Hi, Vintage Gal. Have you been watching that trial? We'll talk about the, that trial tonight. At least I got Jodi Arias reading off before I fell asleep because that, that was really embarrassing last night. And then I also have this. And I know Davida did one of these, and I actually thought, because I have one of these that's a real pocket, like it's a real male pocket, like back here, you put stuff in it. But this one is a heart, and I'm thinking like, well, what do I want to do? What do I want to decoupage that with, like, especially in the center and then here? But really, what is, what is this? If it's not, it should have the pocket. So I'm confused. But I do have the, the gnome. Oh yeah, the gnome. Yeah, maybe I should, I, see, I, I don't have the vision for, I gotta go back and look at Davida's thing. Don't have the vision on that one. And then the acrylic pouring. Let me just, yeah, I don't know, I'm scared, I'm scared to yeah, try that. What? I'm scared to try that. Yeah. Let's see. Let me see. I see everything is. Um, I know I have to watch. I, I would never. I don't think I would ever attempt it without watching another video. I don't think I would. This is also trying. If you didn't see this before, I have to see. But so you see, it's in heart. Can you see it? Yeah. Okay. I showed it to Gorta. because you can cut this out and then use this as your border. It's probably... That would be cute. Probably do that. But now it's... Um, I do have this box over here too that I could do something on. I'm not sure what I want to do on there either. Decide, I can't even decide what I want to do on there either. I wasn't so indecisive so far. I know what I could do. I can't really do it yet because I don't know. I'm I'm, I'm extremely boring right now. So, all right. Uh, I should have thought this out better. I thought these would dry faster. They're not drying as fast today, and now I just see that there's something. Hold on a minute. There's my survey map over here. Over here. I don't know if I just dropped the layers yet, but just smooth that out. Okay. So, um,. I don't know. I guess, I guess I'll let you go because I'm not going to, this is not going to dry and I don't have um, anything else ready. Sorry about that. Sorry I'm such a disappointment today, but 
All right, that's uh, how you do that, and I'll come back later. All right, and then maybe I'll put it into its own video. But yeah, if you want to get the word out about uh, Lauren, I did put that up on its own video. Hi, Delta Dawn, everybody. So I don't know what else to do. Let's about it with that. So I could do this one, let me see. If I find the one. I want to do this. And this is, this is, I'm not even going to paint them. This, you get these right at the Dollar Tree, and then they're all done inside. So you can just. Yeah. Something like this pretty rose napkin. See how that would look. Let me just move this. Ah, get over there. So if I use this, and I wanted to put this pink here. I could do that on the top of like that. And with that nice white, it doesn't, you don't have to, you can go with gold around here if you want to, or you just leave it white for this. So, I mean, I would uh, just take this. Let me see how that all go. Okay. I'm going to be staring over my shoulder. I don't like anybody. Why? I don't like anybody staring over my shoulder. Staring? Yeah, you're like. I was looking, Mom, I'm waiting for something. Get up here. You're a little snack. Uh, yeah, well, I had to see if it, it didn't work for what I needed it to anyway. What do you mean? There's only one way to find out. It's from St. Jude. Oh, nice. Don't, don't leave it on the edge. Why? You shouldn't leave it on the edge. Okay. Like a I thought you were pretty good. Right. No. Hmm. No, you, do, you can turn it around and tweak it. If you want, I guess. It is the scene that happened that doesn't show. Sorry about the noise. Yeah. It doesn't show. So what I think I would do, I'm going to cut this out because I'm going to put the butterfly on, but I want to, I don't want to lose the butterfly. I do. So I think if you pop, if you pop that balloon, we'll have the we'll have the skeleton of all the strings. Of course, of course, that's the whole purpose. Oh yeah. Yeah, you know I've done that before with the eggs. Remember? No, I forgot. You forgot when I made the string eggs? Yeah. The eggs. The string eggs. They were all covered with string, and the, you don't remember them? I saw string. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to make them. But you really think I did, I didn't know what I was doing? No, I didn't. I mean, I, I, I what do you mean? Like did you see? Oh, oh, you knew that. That was my purpose. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna put it like that. that really? I thought you just because it looks nice just the way they are. I thought that was it. I don't know. I don't you know. never did that as a kid? No. I think we used to use hairspray as a kid, right? Don't some people use hairspray with that? I don't know. I think they do. I I know. I I remember doing it. I think my sister did it or something. But I think we used hairspray. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm just totally misremembering everything. I don't even know, now that I'm thinking, if we even did that as a kid or something. I thought we did, but I think we did use hairspray or something. I don't know. I'm losing my mind, if you haven't noticed. Okay. 
I want to do that, but then I'm figuring how am I going to get this butterfly in there. I have to get the butterfly in there. I've got to cut out something over there and let that butterfly go in there. Let's see. I think I can put that butterfly there. It's going to be too awkward for the top. Now, now I'm second guessing even using this. See what I mean? I'm just like totally changing my mind. And I think I want to use this over here. Is not my creative spirit. I think I did find something I'd like to use on this vase. I wonder how this would go. I know I'm all over the place. So if I did the teacup. On one side. And then that one on the other, and I have to cut. But let me see where I would want to cut. All right, let's try this. And now I have to cut it in half right away. And let's see what happens. Let's see if how far we are. Okay, we still have some, some to cut. Yeah, we have a lot to cut still. So I think we gotta cut almost that up to there. Hmm. Okay. So I think.
What is that? Hot dog taco. I thought you just had sausage out. I was going to, but I can't do it. Because, you know, I didn't want to do too much more. It would take too much time now. You know? So I still have to go okay, a little bit. Into that, but that would be a cute spring vest. And then on the top, I would just do um, the jute stuff. So I think I will do that on there. I still have to trim some of this. Office? No. Yeah. It is a little different. Huh? It does smell a little bit different. I really can't believe you don't remember I made all those string eggs and we had them hanging by the fireplace and I had the balloons with Ethan and everything. Little balloons and I had them all over the counter. I just didn't pay attention how you made them. And we used to. I didn't think about it. Okay. And you were working at the time, but. Uh, you used to come home and the counter was full of them and then I popped them. All right, let's see. He was, he was working out, outside uh, from home. So he probably is not on me as he is now. Okay. Let's see. So yeah, I think I would do that, but I'm just trying to see when I get to over here. I want to go over with this one, and that would almost meet there, but then we would have the dragonfly, so. Yeah, I think that's good. All right, and this has to go over. All right, so this one, this piece would be put on first. And, um, I have to show in the blog, the blog post on the eggs. I think I even have a YouTube video on it, but it's from the blog post. Okay. Perfect. I want to make sure that's yeah, that, that definitely is there. Okay. So that's how I would do that one. And then I would put the jute on it and I don't think I'm gonna do that right now because you're gonna come down and you know, eat or something. So all right, I have No, not with that. I can't with all this. So I'm gonna. All right. Uh, I'll see you guys later, and these have to dry anyway. And then I'll show you. No, they'll just wait. Okay. All right. Love you guys. God bless. Bye bye.